OMG BBG! What's going on guys? Welcome back to another Beyblade Geeks video. Today we have an extreme product for you. This is going to be an insane upgrade to your everyday Beyblade X gameplay. This right here is called the Extreme Ripcord by Noozle3D. So it's actually a 3D printed part designed to work with our Beyblade X winder. This right here is going to elevate our Beyblade X gameplay. So we are always super excited to check out 3D printed parts and accessories by third parties and this is no exception. We saw this online and we saw other people in the community using it and it looks insane. So we decided to buy it ourselves and to check it out. Right here we have two ripcord launchers. We actually got the yellow version because we felt like it was a cool color. You can also get other colors um, on the website as well. It really pops. But yeah, look at this. Like. It's extremely long, like what the heck? Crazy. This is a regular Baby X winder ripcord, and then this is the extreme ripcord. Oh my goodness. It's so long. With a longer ripcord like this, the more teeth that it has and the more rotations that it will create for the base. So if you launch super hard, super quick, you would be able to achieve a longer rotations per minute. And you can tell that inspiration from the handle of the ripcord, right? Like that Dragoon ripcord. A ridiculously long Beyblade X ripcord for the absolute most extreme launches that you could ever ask for. A total of 248 usable teeth. This ripcord is not a joke and should be used with caution. Beyblade X launchers are not designed to handle the amount of power this ripcord can create and may cause premature wear to Beyblades and launchers. Oh man, this thing seems dangerous. It's so dangerous, it makes me want to use it all the time. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, this is intense. Look at the comparison between a regular ripcord, right? Take one. This thing is as long as my arm. Like, look at that. Who thought of this? You deserve a raise. All right, so I got the ripcord, extreme ripcord onto my Beyblade X winder launcher. Wow, like, thing, look at this. It's just like whipping back and forth. Dude, the pullback <laughs> is gonna be crazy, man. You're gonna have to do like full extension when you pull. Oh my God, my arm, is it even long enough to pull this far? All right, so what should we do? Got hey, a hey. Hell's Chain. Okay, okay. Dude, it's it's dripping onto the, <laughs> the stadium. <laughs> yeah, man. All right, yeah. all right, gotta reposition, right? You gotta reposition. Swing to the left or swing to the right? <laughs> Curving left is better because you know you got the the actual launcher coming out of this side. So let's just leave it on that side. All right, I'm gonna let's let's go solo first. Cause like I don't want to break it. I don't know how durable this thing is. But all right, three, two, two one. Go shoot! Wow. Okay, okay. I hear that sound. That was not even that hard. But I definitely utilized all 248 uh, of these teeth. Okay, so that was like a slow one. Let's do a fast one. Dude, but that slow launch is equivalent to like a full power regular launch with a regular winder. Oh, all right, all right. Man, this is kind of annoying. <laughs> <laughs> and then we're supposed to battle with each of us having one of these? Yeah, I know, right? All right, three, three two, two, one, one go, go shoot. Wow. Oh my Woo! God. Yo, the RPM. Oh my God. RPM is insane. Okay, I think. I'm liking this. I like this. It's working. Of course you like longer. Longer is better. Every centimeter matter. Three, Three two, two, one, go shoot. Wow. Okay, yeah, you gotta be careful though, cause like, it does whip back and forth. So you gotta launch with a, with a grip, it's probably better. All right, so I have a night shield with a needle tip, so it's not supposed to go that fast, but with the extreme winder, let's try it. Three, two, one. <laughs> kind of whipped my uh, finger a little bit, but that was fast. Here we go. Hey, let's try. Yo, don't whip me, bro. I don't know who whip you, this is like, how I battle. Bro, like, I'm like, <laughs> off to the side, like, don't whip me, bro. <laughs> you know, both on the left. <laughs> <laughs> like this. Okay. Three, three, two, two one. one. Shoot! Oh my oh shark my edge! God. It's too long. 
shark control, control. For sure. Okay, I need my shark edge to go crazy. Yo, Put my hair back and forth. Put my hair back and forth. Cross. Back and forth. Yo, sword fight. <laughs> Three, two, one. Oh, okay, let's yo. go. Okay. Shark Edge is like a little too wild. Yo, this legit reminds me of like the rev up speeds. The first couple of seconds, the acceleration is unreal. High velocity. Three, two, one, shoot! <laughs> Another burst instantly. <laughs> I like bursted myself, man. That it's was like, way too fast. It's too fast, ends the battle too quickly. Do we need two defense type or two stamina types or something? Here we go. Dude, I can't, I can't control this. Go get it on that side, man. <laughs> Yo. Oh my god. Oh my god. This side. This side. Get it together. Three, Three two, two, one, shoot. Yo, wizard arrow, chill, bruv. Oh my god. Wow. <laughs> Another burst. Okay, you know what? I have to admit, I did not use full strength for that one. I think I'm like too scared to launch Same. Strength, bro. Okay, let's just try one that's like full, full on. I'm scared to hurt my hands. We should probably wear like safety gloves and glasses nah. or something. I need a baby. <laughs> let's do this. Three, Three two, two, one, shoot. I launched way harder this time. Same. <laughs> <laughs> So hard, you just jump into the pocket. That seems to be a very common theme with these winders. Ooh. Yeah, it definitely hurts a little bit more to grab the Beyblade, so... The winder is working! Three, two, one, shoot! Okay... <laughs> Too fast, Instant man. Instant death. It's even making Wizard Arrow fall out by itself. A little too extreme? What do we think? Three, two, one, shoot! Okay, I lost way harder this time. Oh! Burst it immediately. <laughs> They're just hitting so hard, man. Yep. And also, the bays are not like meant to go that fast, right? I, I haven't seen them move like this before. <laughs> All right, guys, so that's pretty much it for the unboxing of our Extreme Ripcord. What did you guys think of this? It was definitely really fun to be able to test this out and it definitely pays tribute to the first gen like OG days with the extreme long rip cords. So I'm liking it in this generation. Uh, sometimes I feel like the baits go too fast though. So you gotta like, keep that in mind. And it is a little bit dangerous and also you can't use this in tournaments. It's illegal uh, to use in a official capacity. So just make sure you guys know what you're getting into. But yeah, definitely would recommend. Quality is pretty good too. Um, if you guys want us to do some extreme battles with these two, let us know in the comment section below. But other than that, make sure you guys like the video, subscribe, and as always, peace out.